The subjects of a search and seizure warrant are entitled to have their witnesses present during the entire duration of the raid or search to avert any possibility of planted evidence by those conducting the search. A ma mandated procedure that was allegedly and completely disregarded by the raiding teams on the Tevez properties early this morning. Our Las Moras has more. The Camp of Negros Oriental 3rd District Representative Arnie Tevez was not surprised over the police raid of some of the lawmakers' houses due to alleged illegal possession of firearms. According to Attorney Ferdinand Topasho, the congressman's legal counsel, they already had a prior intel about it and it was okay for them as it was a legitimate operation. But they were just wondering why there were no witnesses allowed during the raid. Ang uh, aking information from the ground is... Uh... And the raid, ngunit, yung mga occupants po na pawang mga babae, ano? Mga, uh, yung mga sa women sector uh, ni uh, Congressman Tevez at ang kanyang abogado na nakastandby na nga po ron dahil uh, ina-anticipate na namin itong uh, raid na ito, ay pinalabas po ng bahay at ay papasukin. Gusto sana lang i-witness yung raid na nandoon naman sa batas na yan that, that there must be at least two witnesses. The Tevez camp also had this to say on the issue of loose firearms. At lahat po, as of yesterday, lahat po ng uh, barel na covered ng mga cancelled, uh, cancelled na LTAP ni, uh, uh, Kwan, ni uh, Congressman Tevez ay nai-surrender na po namin sa kapulisan at may mga resibo po kami. Wala na pong hawak in the possession of uh, Congressman Tevez or any other person acting on his behalf na firearm na covered ng mga LTAP na kinansila ng PNP. Apart from this, the Tevez camp reiterated the lawmaker was not involved in the assassination of Negros Oriental Governor Ruel de Gamo, as well as in other killings in 2019 that were being brought up to right now. For the de Gamo family, this was their message. It will not serve the ends of justice kung ang maling tao ang uh, maaakusa. Sapangkat ang dapat pong hinahanap talaga ay yung tunay na gumawa eh. Ha? yung tunay na gumawa nito. So, uh, while we understand their grief, syempre, uh, I, I can only imagine kung, kung anong nararamdaman nila, ay uh, let us uh, join hands in a mutual search for justice here. As of the moment, Congressman Tevez is still out of the country, but his camp clarified that he is not hiding. Yesterday, his travel clearance from the House of Representatives has already expired, and although he asked for extension, House Speaker Martin Romualdez said he already advised Congressman Tevez to come back as soon as possible to face the controversies. For its part, the Office of the House Secretary General also expressed willingness to cooperate and help the authorities if needed. Ang requirement namin, we must be notified formally. No? We must receive this request from the OJ or any uh, courts of the land no? of the country before we can act on it. Kunyari, may warrant of arrest. Then we inform the congressman concerned about this warrant of arrest, if ever there will be, no? Melalas Moras for the nation.